Hey guys, welcome back. I'm I'm just doing a reaction video to this geezer, this vegan teacher, and now he might get a copyright strike, but don't worry, okay? Um, yeah. So I'll sit back and enjoy the video. Hello, students. My name is Miss. Viewer, why does she call the viewers their students? Because. We ain't students. Some people can be, some people are not. But we aren't students. I'm a YouTuber. I lost my job. But you're not a teacher. You know that. You're a fired primary school teacher, as Daz says. Well, Daz games. But. Like, what the fuck? Miss Katie, I am that vegan teacher. Thank you for coming. And your name's Katie, so. That's not a human. Don't say that is right, but. Why are you saying that now? But Van Horse daughter, did they naturally and then basically you can help ban horse daughter for human consumption or any other any other purpose? Well, yeah, just fuck that. I got a bunch of fa I got a bunch of um, horses on my farm. It got like 30 on my farm. Coming to class? Well, she calls it your viewer. She calls us class. So, like. And. The only thing I've noticed. it. Look at the shit. Look at the shit uh, font on that. That looks shit. Today we're going to learn about horses. We must end the animal holocaust that's going on right now. Well, there's no... Ho Have a look at this site. There is no such thing as the holocaust. What does the holocaust comes into this? Are you saying you like don't like Jews or something? I have to be really careful here, but what the fuck? I'm sorry about that, but... What the fuck are you talking about right there? I just put on American accent just then, but I wanted to do. So, what the fuck? So, like, what the fuck are you talking about? Hey, it works now! <laughs> right. It's called banhorseslaughter.com. Please write it down or memorize it. Ban horse. We need to shut up! I fucking hate you! slaughter.com let's have a look you can help ban horse slaughter for human consumption or any other purpose well I just read that oh, and I pressed the wrong fucking thing have you ever eaten horses no you're in America not in Canada oh, I haven't hacked you or anything but what the fuck why not you eat all the other animals might as well eat horses too. It's horrific what we do to animals. What? Do you know that's a Welsh stallion, right? That's a Welsh stallion picture, and that's a copyrighted picture. Well, that's a well, that's a good sight. Thanks for subscribing, you two. Canada slaughters horses. It may be hard for some to believe that tens of thousands of horses are root. You're on a green screen. And you're on a MacBook too. Why the fuck are you on a MacBook? Well, MacBooks are quite good. So, yeah. But I have an 8K, I have an 8K PC. What, why are you actually using a green screen and with a website that has nothing to do with ho routinely slaughtered in Canada for human consumption, but you can help us ban horse slaughter in Canada like, what and are you fucking talking Some about? of the meat is What the fuck? I don't know my language, but fucking Fucking stupid.
consumed in Canada, and much of it is shipped to the Europe, to Europe, the European Union, and other markets, including China and Japan. If you no an ad. If you guys have not heard of Grammarly, then you are truly. What is that face? Oh. Missing out because Grammarly is a digital writing assistant that helps. This barbaric practice is currently banned in the United States. So horses from the United States are shipped to Canada. That's how they get around their laws. So Americans are not any better. And to Mexico to be slaughtered there. In addition, Canada allows for the transportation of live horses to Japan to be slaughtered for human consumption. Not true and at all. Unfortunately, the transportation of horses is destined uh, destined for slaughter within Not true at all, and that's a fake fake uh, fact there. Eh? It's her opinion. It's her stupid brain. In Canada and by air is far from humane. What the fuck? What the fuck are you talking about? I need to shout because I need to fucking get in on my fucking nerves. Why the fuck? What? Like, why the fuck are you talking about right now? What the fuck? It's only been like six minutes, but I got more than this. What are we doing putting horses on airplanes at all? You can't put horses on airplanes. They won't breathe. They die if they get. They can't breathe. They can't breathe. How stupid do you think you are? And anyway, I'm not talking about you, ma'am. I'm not. I'm not saying you're stupid or anything. Ever. They cut the circulation off and fucking die. On the plane. What the fuck? How stupid do you think you are? Oh, stupid! Well, yeah, you're very stupid. I can tell you that, Casey. There is no reason to put a horse, tie the horse up, and guide it into an airplane. You can't put it on an airplane. No. If you think about it, you can, but... They'll be dead if they come out. No, they'll be dead if they come out at the other end. You're being stupid. And I'm making that a print. I'm making that the um, thumbnail too. Leave animals the fuck alone. Not the fucking you one. Leave them in a field. Don't touch them. Don't breathe them into existence. Don't ride them. Don't try to. Riding is fine. They get the strength up in that. And you don't know anything about agriculture, do you? We know a lot more than you, because you're stupid. You're annoying me as well, because I'm fucking annoyed. If I was your principal, I'll fire you right on the spot, because what the fuck are you talking about? I need to make this video. You tame them. They don't belong. What? What's wrong with you? All I've heard is bad language from the bedroom. Ma'am. It's not necessary. There's nothing, there's nothing negative. I don't want you to hear, I don't want you to hear. No, I'm making a video, I'm making a video, so don't have to disturb it. No. I know. I you hope it's not a swearing video. Yeah, Randy it is. Jackie sees it. And Randy Jacqueline doesn't see it. Oh, no, it won't. No. Long to you. I know I won't get banned. I know that because the swearing's allowed on YouTube. They don't belong to us. They are not meant to be. They actually are. If you own them. Ridden. They are not meant to be eaten. They are meant to be left with their families. They are actually not. I think you're stupid. And the animal holocaust. Stop putting them behind bar. We don't do that. We literally put them behind fences and literally do stuff. But that's not bars. They're fences. They can do whatever they want. Stop treating them like objects. They're, they're definitely not objects. Horses they're animals. 
and you're really stupid. Like Daz Black said, or Daz Games, as he as he's uh, more commonly known on Vine, he's known for. So yeah. They have been someone's pet. Here's a, a quote by Mary Bennett, banhorseslaughter.com. That's what it is. I'm having a look. Hang on. B A N. I really spelled that wrong, didn't I? S S L S S L L E. S L E U U. HT. Yep, it is. It's a real, it's a real company. I do have a look at it. Yep, this is the thing that she found. Uh, sorry, Marie. And thank you to Marie who, and many others who care so much that they start these petitions, they start these sites. There are so many unsung heroes in our movement. Canadians are horrified to see some countries eat dogs and cats. Yet in Canada, a largely unknown business, beloved horses are being tortured and killed for their meat for human consumption. Incl Not true at all. Including pets. It's hashtag horse shit. I just had a look at that. Look. Hashtag horse shit. People are surprised to learn that horses are being slaughtered in Canada for human consumption. Horses that may have been someone's pet. Perhaps even worse, horses are being exported in cramped conditions to Japan to be slaughtered for meat, says Rebecca Breder, Breder Law Corporation. 14 ways you can help ban horse slaughter. One, sign MP sponsored petitions. That's a member of parliament. If you're in Canada, you can sign this petition. If you're not in Canada, start your own petition in your own country to- No chance, mate. Ban whatever- You're more hated in light. Terrible ways that animals are being treated. Don't waste your time writing petitions trying to get animal rights activists off TikTok and off YouTube and off of any other social media. Instead, go to what actually matters. Stop those who are hurting, physically hurting, attacking with knives, putting in gas chambers these innocent animals. Stop trying to ban animal rights activists. We're just the messengers. No, you're not. You're not the messengers, you're just annoying. Canadians, please sign this MP sponsored petition. It will be presented to the Canadian Parliament, and the more signatures it gains, the more clout it has. That's Time is of the essence here. If you're watching this a month from now, this is be, it'll be too late. But if you watch it today, and you're Canadian, or you know a Canadian, please send this to them and have them sign it now, today. It's so important. Actually, no, it's not important. How is it important if it's uh, actually doing it? Please share on all your social media accounts using 
hashtag ban horse slatter, ban horse shit, ban live export. You can't. Hang on. That, I want to know. It's a ship, not a plane. You can see uh, on Instagram what you should tag here, ban.horse.slaughter on Instagram, and horse slaughter uh, uh, underscore here on tw Twitter. So take a screenshot of this right now. Do you know how to take a screenshot with your computer? If you have have an apple you go a uh, command shift 4 and then you do a thing like this you go around it and you can take a, a screenshot of that and you can I think you're a bit stupid right now and remember it or come back to this video after so you should shine, sign and share that support a groundbreaking legal battle There's no such thing as a legal battle this is by uh, Breder Law Corporation they are in Vancouver, BC. In Canada. <clears throat> Listen to what she says here. This is Rebecca. One of my bigger cases now is acting for the Canadian Horse Defend Coalition. We are suing the federal oh. government for violating animal transportation laws. Why the fuck is the government even violating laws to begin with? How did it end up that ordinary citizens have to stand up and waste their time defending these innocent animals? Where is our government? Why does the government not on its own just think to itself, oh, this is wrong? How is it that we have laws, or even even just shitty laws, terrible laws? Yeah, it's shitty laws, mate. Laws, not enough laws. Why do we have laws that, that allow this to happen in the first place? Or why are these people not arrested? This is the question you must ask yourself. What's happening? Not enough good people are speaking out. It's not good enough that you're just vegan. It's not good enough. It's I know, for a fact, it's not gonna happen. Not good enough that you just ride your horse happily and you're taking care of your horse. We have a moral responsibility to take care of all the sentient beings who are suffering. Imagine you could turn this into this. Or this into this for free by doing something you do several horrific one of my biggest cases now is acting for the Canadian Horse Defense Coalition we are suing the federal government for violating animal transportation laws this is a groundbreaking case as it is the first time an animal protection organization has sued the Canadian Canadian government over the way it transports animals. Yes. Way to go, Rebecca Breder. You guys follow her, find out how she, where she is, follow her on Twitter, support her. You know, these, anim no, these animal won't. defenders are often so heartbroken. They work day and night to try to protect these innocent animals. Any kind of hope that you can give them, a little note, a, a, a support, a share of this post, tell her that you have seen this video, that you've seen that vegan teacher defend her, that vegan teacher praise her, and let her know so she doesn't feel like she's all alone there. I'm not saying she's alone, but every well, single you never animal know, rights alone, activist but appreciates nothing else a little bit of for me, good. All of it's bad, because this is basically Dad's blackest information. Well, this is definitely my information, because this is my, my mic, because I'm using it as a mic, because I'm right now talking right now because we get so many thousands of people who and an MP means um, member of parliament if you want to know who say I like eating horses I don't care about animals fuck animals that's what you guys uh, like like to say you find it just blank <laughs> hilariously funny and we are here being the voice of love you know you've just been annoying we are being their voices. They cannot type to you. They can't turn the camera on and say, hey guys, we don't want to die. Hey guys, guess what? We actually don't really want to go on an airplane. You can't put an air, you can't have a horse on an airplane. You have horse on ships. For eight hours? We want to be in a field. We want to run. We don't want to shit and piss in an airplane. 
the fuck are we doing up here? It's scary. Why are we tied up so tight? Oh, you tie us up so tight so that we can't try to run and break free. And then they murder them. What is wrong with us? Do you know how many thousands of animals are put on boats alive, crammed? Thirsty, hungry, suffering, terrified. We need a vegan world. We need to end speciesism. A vegan world does not mean that suddenly the lions are going to stop eating the zebras. What it means is that we are going to work so hard for lions. Zebras are actually a whole sp part of family, alright? So, no animals have been harmed. Well, they have. But, not at the time I've been uh, recording and to uphold those laws to make sure that these innocent beings are not harmed and terrified. Why can't we gather together and do that? How hard is it? You just have a massive rat. It's not hard. Put down your video games. Stop playing video games and play the game. don't. For what? No, you're not. Right. For what? No, you're not. Yeah. No, you're not. Wait, what? No. Why not? Because I got to go up there for work. I'm recording still, so don't need to. Why, um... Game of life. This yeah. actually matters. What? Alright, that makes sense. It doesn't affect you if I'm going away. Up there, I need to go up there. What you're though. doing when you're playing video games is you're tapping a bunch of buttons. Instead of tapping buttons that, that have no purpose whatsoever, except to entertain yourself, and most of you are adults who'd have no business playing these video games, stop. Instead, start signing these petitions. Start speaking out. Start learning the craft of turning your camera on, looking at it, and talking about the animals. Just do it. Even if you suck at it, I make mistakes all the time. But try. Share this petition. Speak out today. Tell people that you know it happens and ask them to think. Not true at all if you know it. Think about it. Have discussions about it. You wouldn't use the same bed sheets for three months. Oh! Oh! You wouldn't use the same. Learn more, contribute, share. That's what it says in the pink. If you have money, contribute to the sharing of this campaign. You can pay money, at, and you and every money, every dollar that you give. I'm gonna skip this over through because it's just in the mind. She even sells merch. Just make this. I'm gonna just do this undercover. And every YouTuber, every YouTuber would be watching this video, right? Would back me up on this because I need to. I need to get. Over 10,000 likes and all that stuff. If you can adopt a horse, and just leave the horse in your pasture. You can adopt the horse, but we live on a farm. Not a chance, because we, we kind of need it. And hang out with your horse. Be sweet. They're not humans, and they're not the animals too. But 
but they're, they're not humans, so why have you said about the Holocaust? Said about something about video games and you you have eaten meat. You've eaten meat. So like, what are you? I'm also making a video about this, but what are you? Like, I don't get you. I don't get you. All right. So, what? Do it. Do what? Support equine rescues and sanctuaries. Support reputable equine rescue and. No one have Mr. Beast. He's fine. Mr. Beast is to do with it. He's fine. But the only thing I want to do is say, peace out for now. If I find a new video to react to, and uh, yeah. So, hope you enjoyed. Put notifications on. Put subscribe. I'll oh, peace out. I might post this today. But I'm not going to be sure. That's not true. I have a, I have a free antivirus, so it is not true. It's a scam. Alright, I'll be back. Peace.